I can't say I'm surprised that Rise went back on his word. But the GRE won't let me just walk away. Waka waka. So if there's any chance that we can get that Antis in, I have to try. So this time he wants me to gather protection money from the surrounding settlements. And after this, he better hand over the drugs. I, I... Take me out to dinner, that might be quite nice. You can buy me a burrito with some beans and rice. But that won't get you wind of pants paradise. <laughs> All right, just so, in case you were curious. I was very curious. I was wondering what uh, if I should take you out or not. Okay. Um. Oh, that's super close. Yeah, we have to go talk to the GRE boys again. Um. Do I have the recipe for the flares? No, I don't. Okay, that's fine. Oh, I'm in deep water. Grain here. Report. Another job for rice. This one's pretty dirty. He's forcing me to collect the money he's extorting from a nearby village. Just do what he asks, and stay close to him. Remember what's at stake. Yeah, crane out. Uh-oh. I'm drinking a Dr. Pops! Go away, go away, go away, go away! Come up here! He's on me! He's on me! That didn't go well. That did not go well. I don't see this ending well. Hang on, I'm gonna try and loop back, or... Just so you can keep running. I'm here! Yay! Oh, I understand all! My name isn't important. What's important is that Rai sent me, and that you owe him some money. I've never seen you before. For all I know, you're just some random asshole. Fuck off! I'll tell you what. How about I break both your legs and drag you through the streets back to Rice's place, huh? And then he can explain to you that you should have cooperated. Okay, okay. Jesus. You are one of Rice's thugs. You guys are the only ones who'd act this shitty. Here, here's your money. Take it. And if I have to come back here... You won't get any more attitude. Mi casa, su casa. Just don't hurt me, all right? It's really messed up. A little bit. Kareem, it's me. So I just threatened to break an old man's legs. <laughs> and it worked, didn't it? Next you collect the tribute from the fisherman's village. Oh, they're even calling it tribute. <laughs> Their messenger always meets us there. Alright, let's try the bow out. Oh, ooh, it even looks cool. Let's see how this works. I want to find one that's alone. I mean, say... it's night time. Oh, here's one. Hello. You missed the head. It's fine. Give me this back. <laughs> Palm and I'll be to the face. Oh. Oh wow! When you actually shoot good. Whoa. Uh oh. I accidentally upset big boy. Tell him to go away. Dropkick boys! Oh god, he dodged it. I'm running back here. Hit him with two arrows. Three. This one's a pin cushion. See what I mean? Look at him. Ow! This one's gotta be almost dead. Which is why he's running. Dropkick boys. Hey, he's running off with like all of my arrows. Can you get them back? Yeah, I can. Wait, did we survive the night? Yeah, night's over. Okay, that's good, because, like... Eh! Uh-oh. I deserve that. Oh. Oh, Sam. Got a lot of points for doing that. Ow! I deserve that. You know what? I'm just gonna force kill, because there's a thing right there. Have you seen that house with the red smoke pouring out of it? 
If Rise's people spot it, they're gonna come knocking on his door. Someone ought to warn him. Look, I've got enough trouble right now, but I'll think about it. All right, red smoke, and then this bad boy. I don't know. Hey, I saw your notice on the bulletin board. Uh, you're a runner. Excellent. That idiot Dawood sat on my glasses in the canteen, and I'm blind as a bat. <laughs> How can I help Alfie if I can't see him? When did he do that? He just shot up the place, place and left. It's not far away. That's a good it's, point. You know, I can't get there myself. You need anything else? And he there? really can't see, oh can he? God, you'll do this for me? No. Thank he thinks you. it was Dawood. Oh, and uh, <laughs> one more thing. See, we're going to start a vegetable garden on the roof, you know, so we can maybe not starve to death. But nobody here really knows how to do it. On my birthday, I, I got a book on gardening. I never read it. It's growing vegetables for dum-dums or something like that. It should be on a bookcase, but, you know, you might have to look around for it. Okay, for, is that the only person we need to talk to here? Yes, uh, we can go. Awesome. Counting on you to right. them out. Shock kick boys. <laughs> What's in this? Shock kick boys. <laughs> ah! Oh, it's trying to eat me with his chest. So a suicider. The cream I just saw yep. something I've never seen before. This huge bloated infected just fucking exploded. Yeah, we call them bombers. Some of our guys use them to kill the other infected. Shoot them, and they take out everything in a three meter radius. There's some loot back here in this room. Me? Keep your distance and you'll be fine. But what about the courier? Was he there? No, I didn't I didn't see anybody, just and there's a I believe there's a note on this table. Right? All right. You'll have to go to the yeah, village I'm... directly. I'm trying a rock picky. Alright, I'm gonna pick this one then. Got it. Ooh, there's some down there too. But that's gonna be a whole ordeal, so let's just. How far away is that? Oh, that's close. It's close enough. These don't open. Oh, this one does. Oh, you went for it? Yeah, he's. <laughs> We're cool, me and him. He just walked through the wall. <laughs> Did he? He literally just turned away from the airdrop and then just <laughs> phased through the wall. And you're so cool with the goon that he clips the wall. <laughs> just to leave. Oh wow, a lot stuff. of people. Oop, there's a. Oh, and the spitters in this game are called toads. Of course they are. Why would they not be called that? That sounded gross. You get headshots for days. <laughs> Except for on the enemies that matter. <laughs> like the toad! This bow really doesn't shoot that far at the end of the day. What about in the morning? In the morning it shoots pretty far. Okay. Oh, I think I found it. Use it. Hey, there it goes. Anybody in there? Shh, not so loud. You'll draw the monsters. Look, I got rid of them, but you better reinforce that gate before more show up. You got rid of them? All of them? Rye sent me. You, Gersel? Oh, you were for Rise. Uh, I should have known this was too good to be true. You've taken enough. You can't have any more freaking telling him. Ayla, please. Just let me talk to the man. You can't just push us around like this. Freaking gonna kick your ass. Do it, freaking. Kick his ass. For God's sake. Look, I don't want any trouble. But we already paid this month. You're gonna bleed us dry. That is entirely not my problem. <laughs> Rise wants his payment, so you make the payment, or things get bad for you. And your woman. You can't threaten us! Kick his ass, Firkin! Give me a break, Isla! Alright, fine, here. This is all of it. Ugh. A real man would have kicked his ass. I'll leave you to it. Sounds like you have bigger problems than money. Why are we being the bad guy? We have done because nothing. The bad guy is the good okay, guy. Okay, Kareem, I got Gersel's money. I fucking hate myself now, but I got the money. The we gotta talk to this bad boy over here. Just one pickup to go at the ferry station on the old pier. There's a ferry. Any guess how those infected got through the fence? Yes, I know exactly how they got in. That masked nut job soared through the husk. 
Who are you talking about? They call him Gas Mask Man. Oh my god, it reminds me if you went nuts in the apocalypse. I swear to god. Gas Mask Man. All the time. Like it's going to protect him. And you're sure it was him? One of the guards saw him cut the husp and run off. Someone's got to do something about that guy. I feel like it's us. I came in with the hazmats, Team Four. It was two days before they sealed the city, and our job was to go door to door and find out who was still all right. So we'd knock on doors. Sometimes you get to go. We started looting, and he fought the zombie off. I feel like this is the opposite of what usually happened. You just sat back down like it was nothing. Hey, hey! Okay, continue with your story, sir. I was thoroughly intrigued. I guess he's done. Oh, we haven't- <laughs> Is he just done? I mean, he stopped mid-story, got up, and then sat back down. Please don't shoot him. No, he's fine. No, I like that story. I've heard it. It's nice. I'm trying, I'm trying. Yeah, here, here we go. You are. Shakur is not taking visitors today. If Shakur didn't want visitors, Shakur shouldn't have sabotaged the fence at the fishing camp. What? What are you talking about? That wasn't Shakur, that was Gas Mask Man. You're Gas Mask Man. Me? You're insane. Why would you think that? Because you're wearing a gas mask? But you have been tricked, my friend. This saboteur was an imposter who makes himself to look like me. So you will be angry at Shakur. But Shakur knows who did this. Shakur saw him without his mask. So you're saying you saw someone disguised as you? I watched him from behind the rocks. He did not see Shakur, but Shakur saw him. Well then Shakur better tell me who it is. <laughs> no. <laughs> My information is far too valuable. If you want to know what Shakur knows, then first you will do a thing for me. Then I will tell you. We're not negotiating, Shakur. Of course not. Shakur tells you what to do, and you must obey. Now, obey Shakur. And what exactly does Shakur want? There's a lake nearby. My treasure bag fell out of the boat and was lost in the water. You must... Oh, okay. Great, awesome. I know where it is, so this will be fast. <clears throat> it's in the deepest part of the lake, which is awesome. I'm a little nervous to kind of go diving. You can stay out, I can grab it if you want. Oh god, yep, yep. <laughs> you, you walk you walk past it. The door's, door's over here. Alright, I've got your bag, why couldn't you get it for yourself? Shakur can't swim. Now, mm. first the bag, then I tell you who is Shakur Imposter. Alright. <laughs> mean throw. <laughs> Okay, Shakur, tell me what you saw. First, the imposter sneaks out of the village. He's very quiet, like a master spy. Then, he puts on a mask. Then, he sneaks back to the gate. But now, he is very noisy, so the guard would see him. Then he cuts the lock and runs away. Did you recognize him? He looked crazy to me. Nothing like Shakur. But do you know who he was? Of course! This one of the fishermen, the one who's disguised as Shakur. All right, I'll check it out. By the way, Shakur, what was in the bag? My air. My precious, clean air. No, I can breathe again. I love him. I do too. Oh, he actually had a gas mask. <laughs> what can I do for you, Crane? You sabotaged the gate, Gersel. You let the infected into the village. Me? He was the crack party of the mask. The, the guard saw him. Yeah, but someone else saw you. Who? What is he? Show me. Well, there's also the mask I found in your hut. Yeah, well, what was I supposed to do? The village didn't want to pay tribute to Rice, and Rice was getting impatient. That's why he sent you, right? 
So you allowed an attack on your own people? I had to convince them that they needed Rise's protection. It did the job, didn't it? So what the hell do you care? Now Musa wants to put a bullet in Gas Mask Man. And that's a problem? Yeah, make sure it doesn't happen or you'll be explaining why you allowed Infected into the village. All right, all right. I'll talk to Musa and the guard. All right. That went over about as well as I expected. Yes. All right, Gas Mask Man won't be bothering you anymore. Did you put a bullet in him? No, that wasn't necessary. After what he did? Look, you may not like it, but murdering people is still kind of a big deal. If you decide it isn't, you and me are gonna have some problems. No problems, mister. I just got mad. I never hurt anybody. Thanks for talking to him. Okay, level up. Awesome. Lord. Hold on, there's one thing over here that I want to try to do. Because it's awesome. What was that? I don't know if we can do it in co-op, but you? hopefully. What do you want? I'm Crane. Looks like what Creed. What are you doing in here? What am I doing? <laughs> what am I doing? My name's Tobias, and I'm designing weapons. Zombie killing weapons. Uh-huh. Okay, yeah, that sounds great. I guess I'll just, uh, just leave you to it then. No, no, wait. Wait, don't go. Don't go. Listen. I've almost finished an ultra weapon of monster destruction. All it needs is some fine tuning, and you can help with that. Right. And then um, this. Here goes nothing. Ready up. Oh, ready for this? We have to kill as many zombies as possible with this. Oh my god, now it actually feels like that island. I lost the lead, excuse me. Yep. I just went I just went away without zombies. Oh dear, it's a goon. Three hits and he was down. I gotta admit, this thing is pretty sweet. Not sure about the battery life, though. I'm here to make a pickup for Rise. Back already? We just paid off, you blood suckers. <sighs> Don't shoot the messenger. I'm just trying to get by like everybody else. Yeah? So are we. Rise said he'd protect us if we paid him. But so far, all he's done is take our money. There's no protection, just threats. You any different? Look, all I want to do is get this over with. What's it going to take, huh? Don't need to point out how easy it would be to set this entire place on fire. Jesus Christ. You people are fucking monsters. All my money's in that satchel. Take it and get the fuck out. Yeah, for what it's worth, this isn't something I want to do. I'd rather be helping you guys. And yet you're still doing it, aren't you? I mean, he's got a really good point. Yes, he does. I don't know where this actually is. Right, awesome. These, uh... Arrows here, I think if I talk to the quest chick, I think you can just burp to me. Hey, what's the matter? That brute Harun threw my sister Ida out of the village. She's a widow with two children, Yasmina and Jamil. They snuck under the fence to go after their mother. Yasmina came back yesterday, but Ida and Jamil are still out there. Please, can you find my sister and nephew and bring them back? I'll do what I can. Where's the girl? In my house. She's hiding from Harun. She thinks he'll throw her out too. Maybe I'll talk to Haroon. Kill him. <laughs> All right. Found her. Yasmina. Hey, oh, it's her. Mom, can you talk to me? Your mom's in danger. I need to find her. She's gone. She was beaten. Haroon oh, well. says you can't be here once you've been beaten. I'm going to get her to a place that has medicine. They won't make her leave. Now, can you tell me what happened to you and your brother? Me and Jamil. 
and went under the fence to find our mom. It took a while, but we found her at the houses behind the tunnel. Only there was a biter there. He beat me, and my mom hit him on the head. You were bitten? Only a little. I tried to get away. What did your mom do? She put us in a house, and then she went to look for medicine. When she came back, she told Jamil to wait there, and then she took me to the man. Did he give you medicine? Yes. He said we would both need more, but that me and my mom could stay in his basement as, as his puppets. I don't know what he meant, but my mom got scared and hit him and told me to run. So I did. It's all right, Yasmina. I'll find her. Where does the man live? I'm not sure. It's a house with hammers and, and axes. And where's your brother? Jamil is hiding in the house with the red flowers. You're a brave girl, Yasmina, but I need you to stay here a little longer, okay? And keep away from Harun until I get back. Can you do that? You're really going to find my brother and mom? Yeah, you bet I will. Thank you, mister. Wholesome. Right, awesome. How did Harun? you get up on top of me? Can't you see I'm busy? Why'd you force that woman to leave the village? You mean Ida? She's infected. All infected gotta go outside. Is that Gersel's rule? Some people don't want to make the tough calls around here. Well, I did. If Ida didn't want to get thrown out, she shouldn't have let herself get bit. Tough luck. <laughs> Bad break. What about her kids? What about them? There's no answers in around here. I was doing them a favor so they wouldn't have to watch us hacking up their mum when she turns into a fucking monster. I'm starting not to like you. Hey, <laughs> I'm not looking for trouble. You seem like a good guy. Have a nice day, okay? Ready for the kicker? Yeah. Now go fuck yourself. Oh. <laughs> I fell. I'm proud of you. At least this time it, you didn't insinuate smashing the head of a crying child. What happened? No, what did I do? The <laughs> last what time uh, we were talking about, uh, you're like, God, that crying needs to stop, and then he crushed a zombie <laughs> oh, yeah. skull. That did happen. Oh my God, where did you come from? <laughs> I'll just heal you as a thank you. Oh, thank you. Where's the... Oh, thank you. I'm doing it for the points. Help, Mom, help! Hang on, take it easy, take it easy. I won't hurt you. You're Jamil, right? I peer yes. in, wearing a I'm bright red mask, covered in the blood of my enemies. Jamila <laughs> was bitten by one of those creatures. So Mom took her to a man that found a medicine that fell from the sky. She said his name was Salim. Do you know where Salim lives? In the tool shop. All right, now listen to me, Jamil. I'm going to go get your mom and come back for you. So you wait right here, okay? Okay, just come back soon. All right, we... Yay. Let's do that. All right. Yes. Uh, up. Up. Okay, up this way, then. All right. Where's the tool shop? How far away is that? Where is that? Oh, that's far up. Oh, yeah. All right, we have to go back under the bridge. Of course. We pretty much need to go back the way that we came to get. Salim. What does the Salim, sign we say? Need to talk. Oh, You're I can't see it. Way. I'm armed, so you better get the hell out of here. You have to let Ida go. You mean that stupid woman? She's dead. She was infected, so I had to kill her. Now her daughter says you have answers in. I don't know anything about this. It has nothing to do with me. Salim, I'm not leaving without her. Oh, yeah? So you want to have a party? What is it? Salim's oh, Mechanical Repairs Servicing yes. Deep and Fast Workshop. Okay, I think we need to get in there and... Can we open this? Getting up on the roof. Yep. Was that it? It Did stopped. It? Yep. You all hunt down our children and feed 
Oh god. Oh, go? I shot him in the head with an arrow and he's fine. The second arrow did it though. That... Oof. I don't like him. Thank you. I think you got him. Alright, look for any loot, any blueprints or anything. Oh, lockpicks. I got both of these lockers open. What is upstairs? Probably a woman. Oh, a statue. I forgot. The collectibles. Up on up on top of this dresser here. Those are like the super collectibles. Yay. The delectable collectibles. A burger. To the basement we go. Got my bow ready. Oh God, what has he done to you? Take it easy, take it easy, you're free. Yes, Mina, my daughter, she went. She's safe. She's back at the village. Your son's still hiding at the house where you left him. What am I going to do? We can't stay in the village. Haron will throw us out again. You're going to take your kids and go to the tower. I want you to find a doctor there named Lena. Tell her that Crane says to take care of you, and that he'll make sure there's enough antizin for you and your daughter. You are Crane? Yeah, yeah, I'm Crane. Now go back to Jamil. He's waiting for you. Yasmina's with your sister. <sighs> Thank you for being kind to me. I didn't think that. Alright, now we can go turn that in. Is there anything else in here that we can grab? There's a poo bucket. Hey. I need your help finding my son Christoph. Oh, good lord. You. Sure, <laughs> for protection. But I can't go to him for a thing like this. My son is... He's young. He thinks with his mouth instead of his head. He doesn't understand that sometimes you've got to go along with people who aren't so good. Now he's run off to join Kraken's bunch at the tower. He thinks he's going to be a runner. That's not the safest line of work. He's going to get himself killed. He's not ready. He's too young to be out there. Shouldn't you be looking for him yourself? You don't understand. I make weapons for eyes. If the new ones aren't ready when his people come, me and Kristoff are both dead. Please, do this for me. I'll give you something good. Something special. Okay? Yeah, maybe I'll ask around at the tower. If I find something, I'll let you know. But if you ask me, your protection seems to have you pretty scared. You should really think about it. Right. Getting a whole lot of quests. I am excited. If you show them compassion, they will see it as weakness. And then I come up and you will your whole life. Understand? I give you shelter, I give you bread, women, bullets, and you can a simple task. I should send every one of you to the pit. Ah, the tower lackey returns. Do you have something for me, friend? Yes, I do. Now it's time for you to give me what you promised. Two crates of Andesin. I think not. Your loyalty to the tower is nothing but blind obedience, Crane. A coward's submission to false hierarchies. You follow their rules as thoughtlessly as you follow mine. Like a good little dog. Look, we had a deal. <sighs> Your people need the antizine. Now, more than ever, I would surmise. But a man who follows someone else's rules is no man at all. Here, I will allow you this much. You promised me two crates of it. This is only five vials. If you want more, I present you with an opportunity. The athlete, the Scorpion, Jade Aldemir, she's one of your number. Bring her to me. 
I have an arena where men fight for our amusement. I would have this Scorpion fight for us. I'm curious how long it will take for someone of her caliber to uh, break. What? No, no, forget it, I'm not doing it. I hear no true conviction in your voice, Crane. You have not yet made your choice, I can tell. Will you be a dog and save the dwellers of the tower? Or will you be a man and save the maiden? Go and think about it. Come and see me when you get back. I've got something for you. I like the tower more. I made my choice. Ah, shit. Oh, boy. Well, before we get into anything else, I think this is where we're going to end the session. I'm stretching. You, I've never seen the jump animation up close. You look kind of weird. <laughs> you whipped back so quickly. gas mask guy I want you to know that I can tell you're talking but I can't hear you so I can see the little wobbly bit next to your help oh bar. I muted my mic for the cutscene yeah there you are I was wondering why you were just repeating the I was because <laughs> I was like yeah I think we should end it there and you're like all right, before we get involved in anything else, right here. Yep. And I'm like, I said that. You did said that. Well, I don't know what how many. Of interest did I say? Something probably. Oh well. Rip the dream. Yep. I've forgotten everything. Yep. I don't know how many cool. videos this ended up being, but in the next one, hopefully, all of my soundproofing will be up. Yay! So, yay! Be sure to check in for the next one because Sam hopes to see you there. Wow, it's almost like he knows my in out out. Yeah, so. yeah, I'm a big I fan. I'll I'll take it.